Hey everybody, I'm Manny. Welcome back to my channel, Soul Cal Shave. So uh, we're gonna get into a pretty kick-ass mail call here, a mail call that I've been dying to get to. I was contacted by a buddy of mine uh, via um, messenger or, or private, a private message through Instagram. I'm sorry, not messenger, through Instagram. And uh, I was included in a pass around. Uh, and excuse me, it is freaking hot out here. I am currently in uh, Goodyear, Arizona. And it is hot as hell. <laughs> it is really hot out here. I sacrificed myself to uh, roll the windows down so the truck wouldn't be shaking and on and you couldn't hear anything. So uh, I'll do my best to get through this without uh, sweating all over all over the place here. But uh, I got a package here. And this is a package, a Royal Mail package, if you guys can see there. And uh, this was, this, this, har this is, Wow, this has already been uh, reviewed by another wet shaver. So if you guys know what this package is, once I open it, you probably already guess or, or know who that person was who reviewed it uh, or got a chance to use it. Uh, so to the original or the only original owner to this razor, thanks again, buddy, for including me in, in for this uh, uh, pass around and getting the chance to try this, uh, this product out uh, or this item out. But here, let me open this up now. Let me take the um, seal off or the uh, tape off. And okay, it's nice and packaged. If you guys can already see what that is, you guys can already probably guess. Let me go ahead and um, take this. Got the little uh, wrapping around it, like foam wrap. And... Okay, just take a look at it. All right. Now, here you guys go. This is the Rex Ambassador. And this is the razor that was designed by uh, Matt Pisarsic at Razor Emporium. And if you guys can see there, I'm trying my best. If you guys can focus that. I don't know if you guys can see that because I'm trying to look in this mirror here in the back. Hopefully, there you go. But this is the Rex Ambassador, the adjustable. So once this drops down, this comes up, and there you guys go. I will be giving giving this uh, a shot here in the near future. There you go. Yes, what a just what what a beautiful razor gotta be careful with it because i cannot afford this razor <laughs> this is an expensive ass razor i'm so stoked to have gotten a, a chance to try this uh but there you guys go um just beautiful looks like great great machining work Now there is a little bit of a um, ding in there. Just want to confirm that. I don't want this to come back to me. Excuse the, excuse the long, dirty nails, guys. Um, but yeah, right there, if you guys can see that. I don't know if it comes off on camera. Something like this, something like this you want to be able to cover your assets, man. <laughs> Definitely want to cover your assets. Um, as far as that, I don't see anything wrong with it. 
it almost looked like someone took a pair of vice grips to it to tighten it down or something um, a little uh, wear on the head this is why I'm also doing the video just to put that information uh, on my video as you know proof <laughs> I'm not saying the uh, I'm not saying the uh, past round uh, was at fault this might have been already what was already on the razor I don't know if you guys can see the little scuff or ding marks um, but yeah just just fantastic phenomenal can't I can't believe I'm actually getting a chance to try this um, I may even get a chance to try this before Chris Maiden at another cut above, so I'm that's pre pretty cool about that. That's been pretty stoked. Um, yeah, uh, I, I'm I'm happy. I'm so I'm so uh, so glad I got got a chance to try that. So I will put this back in its uh, bubble wrap packaging for a later date when I get a chance to knock this out on a shave. So set that aside and there was a letter in there but it's got some personal information on there so buddy thank you for the letter i will read it when i get a chance and the next one is a package that was sent over from russell at wild west shaving company there you go and uh he knew i was doing the month of lavender and wanted to contribute to the channel and send, send some stuff over so he donated some soaps um so i already know what's in here but on top of that i also got my razor back from him i sent out my uh gold dollar to get it uh honed and get an edge put back on it so um he offered he offered a honing service for free uh and i really do appreciate it so thank you very much russell It is freaking hot out here, guys. Well, I am sweating. I can't wait to knock this video out and put the, uh, turn the truck back on and put the AC on full blast. All right. So he sent over. All right. Take a look at the razor first. It's been a long time since since I've seen this baby. <laughs> it just feels weird holding it again. taking a look at it all right so this is my gold dollar i had sent over my uh, gold dollar 66 to get it honed i also sent out my uh, dovo artist shaving razor um to uh frank mesa extract gold shave so i sent out two razors so i can get uh two ideas of two different homes so uh, i'm pretty stoked to get a chance to try that out so uh put that aside there and he sent over yeah it's fantastic he sent over aces and eights because I really enjoyed that soap really really enjoyed that soap and uh, the reason why is because it's got lavender in it for the month of lavender and he also sent over uh, Laramie this is Laramie because it also has uh, fragrances of lavender. There you guys go. Uh, oh, I'm sorry, I bumped the camera. Lavender and bergamot. Now, I don't remember if I've gotten a chance to smell this. I don't know if I have a sample. I don't know what it smells like. Oh, that's beautiful. Wow. That's really nice. I like that. Okay. All right. 
Yeah, yeah. Thank you, Russell. I really do appreciate it. I can't wait to use these uh, for the month of lavender. So got those, the straight razor. Now I picked up a local product uh, from my local Target. And uh, just trying to make sure if I can see what's going on over here. Um, I, I picked up a local product here uh, at my local Target. Super stoked. Uh, not necessarily just with the item, but super stoked because uh, I took a picture of a full line. Finally, finally, um, wet shaving is being recognized. I know you see a lot of things here now and again. You know, little things you know that resemble a wet shaving. Um, is, is is making a boom or making a comeback you, you can see it but to see a full line um at, at my local target was pretty impressive and i will show a picture of it uh in just a minute here but this is the uh product one of the products i saw and this is the uh, shave cream and it does lather up so for, uh, come, uh, um, from what it says on back excuse me i got a had a brain fart there uh, from the information on the back, it does say that uh, you use a brush. Um, what does it say there? Uh, I know I saw it there somewhere. Anyway, I saw it somewhere, so I don't remember where I saw that. Uh, they had a full kit also, so I, I may have saw it on the full kit. Um, so that's that. Uh, here are some of the ingredients. Don't know if you guys can capture that or not. I'm doing my best with what I can here. This is the other side of the box. And I will post a picture right here. Now that picture there is the full line um, of the bevel. So they have, if you guys can see there, they got the uh, the pre-shave, the aftershave balm, um, the razor blades, even the brush, uh, including the cream. Uh, obviously, if you guys can see there. Um, oh, there you go. That's where I saw it. Creates a rich, creamy, uh, a rich, creamy lather. Um, I know I saw it somewhere. Um, but yeah, so pretty stoked to have gotten a chance to see that. Um, it's not nothing crazy, um, but I mean, come on, Gillette, if you're watching, you know, get on board, you know, put some, put some fuel in your meal and some gas in your ass and get back on, you know, get on board with this, man, because, you know, uh, Gillette needs to make a comeback with these razors and, and uh, the, the Gillette creams and stuff like that that they had back in the day, you know, but it's pretty cool to see that uh, um, Wet Shaving is making a comeback, so that's pretty cool. Um, but yeah, that's all I got for you guys today. Um... Hopefully when I get back home, I'll finish uh, or get ready to knock out another shave. Don't know if I'm gonna use uh, uh, my straight or don't know. I, I don't know what I have set up yet. I, at the moment, I really don't. Um, but yeah, that's it guys. Uh, thanks for joining me. If you guys like what you see, please like, favorite, share, and subscribe down below. And don't forget to hit that little bat icon down at the bottom so that way you guys get my next future notifications uh, whenever my new videos pop up so that way you guys don't miss out. And I'll catch you guys on the next one. Y'all stay safe out there, later.